guys, so I just got back from the shops and I've got myself a little present today. Um, got myself a little game. It was pretty much an impulse per uh, purchase. I was gonna get this thing anyway, but I decided to um, just kind of leap in and do it today, why not? So, I went, went in and I got myself Far Cry 5. I grabbed the little disc cover from the shelf and went down to the counter thinking I was just gonna get the standard version, um, handed over my $100. And I ended up getting this bad boy, the Steelbook edition, which is really, really cool. I was not expecting that at all. As you can see, it's got some really amazing features there on the back. So, bargain. I was quite surprised when the guy pulled it out from under the counter. I was like, seriously? Awesome. So, I'm going to unbox this sucker because people like unboxing videos for some strange reason. Why? Anyway, let's do it. I got this with, um, I bought Supernatural season eight or nine one year. I can't remember which season it was, but I got this little um, doodad in the box. Um, I don't know what that has got to do with the show. It's a little screwdriver set and it's got a level and a little um, flashlight, which no longer works. But um, I thought, hell, it's now become my official DVD box opener thing. So let's do it, yep. Yeah? With a little bit of a screech on there, try not to damage any of the box work. Exciting, we've been looking forward to this. The trailers to this kind of looked amazing, so really been looking forward to picking it up. Nice. Oh. Alright, let's open this bad boy. What do we get inside? Woohoo! Things! Things and stuff inside here. Let's have a quick so naturally, that's a really nice box just saying, that's really cool, I like that. So naturally, we get the game, and that has got some more about the game on the back, and inside here, put it down, this is what I picked up off the shelf, so this is what I was expecting to get, so bargain, once again, same stuff. There. So we got, oh, the the soundtrack. I haven't really bought a CD in years. I kind of download everything these days. So we got the the soundtrack in there, which is really nifty. Hoping that is pretty cool. Nice. And here we have some stuff in a nice little envelope. Opens up. Ooh, okay, this is going to be falling out everywhere. Welcome to Hope County, Montana. Oh, it's a map. It's the map. It's a huge map. Just kind of like um something similar in Grand Theft Auto 5. So there you go. So, oops, got another bit. So a nice big map. I never use these things anyway, I kind of just explore and run around and just have fun. But, it's nice to know they've got a big map here, should I ever get truly lost. And then we've got the big poster on the back. Boom. So that is pretty, pretty nice. Considering that, um, oh wow, how's this go back together? Considering I wasn't really expecting all this with my purchase today, I was just getting what I thought was the standard edition. It's pretty nice. So I put all this back in here. Like I said, I'm never probably going to use that ever again. I need my trusty gadget again. Boom. So, here we go, the trusty game. So, and what I don't get, right. But I'm not complaining, this is just an observation. I mean, we've got the game, right. Um, is that going to fit in that? No, it's not going to fit in that. So what do I do with that sleeve when I put the game in here? I mean, shouldn't the game have just come in the steel box? Just, well, once again, just an observation. Just seems weird. But it's very pretty though. And yeah, so we've got the game. Once again, all the stuff about the back. Oh, on the back there, then we got my codes. Oh yeah, I've got some, um, you know, looking. Got some codes and stuff for some downloadable content. Forgive me if I don't just broadcast that everywhere. Uh, season pass. Some more advertising. 
in here, the usual stuff. And then once again, a little booklet. With, if you want the game instructions, game instructions go to support.ub.com. I remember buying these games, I've been playing PlayStation games, Xbox, Nintendo 64 games for years and years and years and years and years. And it's always been that you get a little leaflet inside your game with the instructions for the controller so you knew what to do. But now the game's more about giving you tutorials. Mid-game you start off and you kind of get thrown in, which I really, really, really like. It's nice. But to have that um, little that quick flashcard to say, shit, how do I go up? How do I jump? All that kind of stuff. Eh, it's an old dude complaint, really. But I'm about to go and load this up and spend my afternoon doing this while the other half is out shopping. So I've got some PlayStation 4 time. And yeah, it's been a while since I've cranked it up. So yeah, I'm excited to, to dive in. I've heard good things about this. Like I said, the trailers look amazing. And yeah, let's do it. Anyway guys, thanks for checking into my little unboxing video of Far Cry 5. Have fun, and I'll catch you in the next video. Thanks for watching.